more about that uh, when we get to the immune system. Okay. But uh, having a capsule usually increases the virulence because it uh, basically shields itself from the immune system. The immune system only see like a lot of a lot of uh, sugar. It doesn't necessarily recognize the bacterial component. Okay, so having a capsule. All right, so uh, now I will just quickly talk about bacterial cell wall. That's very important, okay? So I'll stop after doing the bacterial cell wall, okay? So bacterial cell wall contains a material called peptidoglycan, okay? You don't need to know the exact chemical structure, but as you see, it's got amino acid, it's got sugar. Right, the sugars are called N-acetylglucosamine and N-acetylmeramic acid, okay? So those are the two types of sugar. But, it's from, but, it's, uh, but it also has a, a protein bridge, okay, a peptide bridge. All right, so now we will talk about the fundamental difference between two types of cell wall, gram-positive versus gram-negative. I have a diagram comparing these two. The video does suggest gram-positive and gram-negative bacteria. Now, this is a very important classification of uh, bacteria. So whenever you have a bacteria, the first thing, the first question you want to ask is whether the bacterium is a gram-positive versus a gram-negative bacteria. Uh, because the, the structure are very different, okay? So in gram-positive bacteria, they have a very thick layer of cell wall, only one cell membrane. And then uh, some unique uh, uh, um, uh, acid called uh, tachoic acid, lipotachoic acid, okay, combination of sugar and fats, okay, so some unique sugar on the gram positive cell wall. That's gram positive bacteria. Now, in gram negative bacteria, the cell wall is actually much thinner, right? Uh, but there are actually two layers of cell membrane. Okay, so in gram-negative bacteria, there are two layers of cell membrane, a thinner layer of cell uh, wall that is in between the two layers of cell membrane. All right, so outer membrane, inner membrane. That's why there's a periplasmic space. So the term periplasmic space means it's between the two layers of cell membrane. All right, so, uh, and uh, the cell was actually inside the uh, uh, the peptidoglycan cell was inside the uh, periplasmic space. Now, on the outside of the uh, gram-negative bacterial cell wall, you have uh, LPS, okay, which is a very, very common thing. So this is, we actually need to remember what LPS uh, is, okay, they are associated with only gram-negative bacterial cell wall. LPS is the, one of the major cause for uh, bacterial sepsis, okay, so when you get a bacterial infection in your bloodstream, uh, LPS that is released into the bloodstream uh, gives you fever, and then uh, your body, you know, when your body sees a lot of LPS, your immune system may overreact and then go into a shock response, okay? So uh, LPS is uh, one of the leading cause of sepsis, which is on the cell wall of gram-negative bacteria, on the cell membrane of gram-negative bacteria. All right, so uh, the two layer cell membrane, okay? So there are also some porins that allow things to get through, okay? But they also have an inner cell membrane. Okay, so this is the fundamental difference between these two types of bacteria, gram-positive versus gram-negative. Now next week we're going to do a gram-stain, okay, to differentiate between bacteria that are gram-positive versus gram-negative. Okay, so uh, now once again this is very important, so you need to know uh, the structure of the bacteria very well. I have multiple questions asking you the differences between the structure of gram-positive versus gram-negative cell wall. You need to remember gram-positive bacteria has a thick layer of pentaboglycan, one layer of cell membrane. Gram-negative bacteria have two layers of cell membrane, only a, only a, uh, a thin layer of uh, cell wall that is sandwiched between these two layers of cell membrane. Okay, so, all right. All right, so uh, it's actually a good point to stop. Okay, so I'll stop here for the lecture. And then uh, let's uh, let's take a 15 minute break. We'll come back at like say five past eleven to uh, do start our lap. Okay, so and then we will.